was in the 90s, after I had for some time perused this curious literature, that I was struck by what proved to be a decisive recognition. It became evident to me that all these quantum reality theorists, unbeknownst to themselves, had assumed the highly dubious premises of René Descartes. The supposition, namely, that the real splits neatly into two disjoint domains, an external world consisting of so-called res extense, or extended entities, and an internal or subjective domain pertaining to so-called res cogitantes, or thinking entities. I felt that I had discovered the source of the difficulty, the hidden premise which has all along bedeviled the quantum reality debate.